what's up guys we're here in beautiful Orlando it's another beautiful Sunday here the weather's great we're hanging out the cars and coffee me and Tommy we're checking out cars we're big car enthusiasts you know so today we're gonna be hanging out but tomorrow it's time to work I'm gonna be doing an update on my 80 gallon tank a lot of changes coming I'm gonna be gluing some corals so I'll see you guys Today is a Monday, we're here at the retail store and things are a little bit different, not so much fun. We're gonna be doing an update on my 80 gallon tank. We're gonna be gluing some corals, some aquaporas, about 30 corals all together. We also, you guys know, I lost my second batch of fish, no proud of it. It kind of sucked, but I ended up putting a UV sterilizer. Things are looking a lot better. So anyhow, I'm gonna be showing you guys a lot more about my tank today, it's been roughly seven months. It's been a struggle to say the least since we started dry, but let's go glue some corals, we got this. So you guys think we sell merch always on this whole wall? You guys been to the retail? This wall is bare right now. What does that say, guys? Stay tuned. If you're coming for Reef of Palooza London, you might want to stop by the store just to come and check some things out. But anyhow, I got some coals all the way back here. Come on in, guys. You guys see that little rack back there? It's got two, four, five, six, seven aquaporas. I'm missing some of my aquaporas. I got to make a quick call, guys. Somebody took my frags. Hey, buddy. Quick question. I'm, I'm gluing the corals on my tank today. There was some that Sean had caught for me on the old 300, you know where they went? Of course, I want to believe this is All right, I'll go find them. Thank you, buddy. Thank All you right. for the lifeline. 9A, we're hunting. Okie dokie, thank you, guys. We found them. It took a little work. Someone's trying to get sneaky with my corals, guys. I don't like this one bit. Sneaky people. Blow with the turkey baster, make sure nothing's coming off. Making sure no funny business are coming out of it. We have two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve aquaporas. That's what's going in. The rest of the coals are inside the tank. Are you guys ready to go glue them? You guys want to do this? Let's go. Come on. So check this out, guys. This is one coral. Don't laugh at me. I want a green slimer on my tank. So I'm going to show you guys the green slimer. We're going to ask Alex where the frags are of the green slimer right now. Alex is one of our store managers, you know. He's been with us for a long time, you guys know him. I'm looking for a frag of the green slimer. Where can I find one? Uh, we don't have any available right now. What do you mean we don't? We don't have any cuts to sell right now. Can you reach there and grab one or no? Uh, no, right? No, not really. There's only one way to fix that, guys. Easy fix, easy fix. Problem fix. If you guys been doing acroporas, fragging acroporas, acroporas out of the world, they got the most distinct smell you will ever smell. It's just, it's kind of nasty. Acropora cologne. Acropora cologne, that sounds like a good idea for the coral addicts. Like, God forbid you go somewhere, let's say you're you're in the mountains, uh, like you're snowboarding or something, and you say, you know what, I miss my, my corals, and you spray a little of acropora smell or something. We're worked out around here, guys. Yeah, I'm working on this little thing. The uh, pump wasn't pumping out enough water for flow and stuff for this uh, little gold torch over there. And so I cleaned it out and uh, it's really pumping now. So I gotta actually turn it down because it's even uh, leaking a little bit. But yeah, it's definitely a lot better than before. His name is Eddie. He's a cutie. How about you, Elvis? Elvis and Eddie. The double E. Guys, we're making t shirts with neon stuff in it. It's gonna be bling bling. All right, this looks cool, guys. Look at this. Hidden skins, hit them up, guys. So we're gonna start gluing some of these corals here, guys. This is the biggest one. Yikes, we got a free frag already. Frag for the pico, I guess. Okay. These acros, uh, they came from two different tanks, from the 500 here in the Orlando store and from the 1500 gallon tank. I cut them maybe about two months ago. I've been waiting, I just wanted to make sure the tank was ready. 
and we didn't feel like we were ready. Remember guys, you guys, if you go back and you watch the episodes for this tank, I started this tank dry. Dry sand, dry rock, dry everything. And it's literally first six months was a huge struggle. It wasn't easy whatsoever. But after six months, I'm seeing core line on the rocks. The cores are doing good. Cores were going pale because I was losing interest for a while while the tank was getting ready. I wasn't feeding enough the cores. I'm kind of like on the light color. I lost a couple of recordias, a mushroom or so. But now I've been feeding multiple times a day. I've been adding some amino acids and what a difference it's been. Street Fighter 2 Champion Edition. If you come to Reef Palooza, you see me in a trade show, come to me and tell me, hey, I know how to play Street Fighter. I'll give you a whooping real quick. I challenge you. No! Chun Li beat us. I'm looking at the sock. I'm looking everywhere for it. Check your other socks. Uh, I only have one. No, the no, one you're wearing. Yeah. Oh, the one I'm wearing? You <laughs> didn't think that was over. The first bank <laughs> that we ever raised in World Wide Clothes history. And, now Lou uh, killed it. No, I don't know where he's at. Somebody named it. That was from. Yeah. His name was Happy. <laughs> wait, 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 what? What's his name? His name was Happy. And now I can't find him. No, he's swimming. He's using the, the hammer. What's he doing down there? Oh. Um, yeah, that might be dangerous. <laughs> Back there behind the hammer there. Get in there, Jimmy. Oh, See if you get him. <laughs> Happy's happy. Happy's back. Say hello to Gadgets, tell him to watch the video. Gadgets? Come see the extension. Come see the extension. <laughs> I heard you, you got some golf clubs now, so come on down. Let's do a little challenge, guys. First one, to send us a DM to tell us who Gadgets is. Obviously, we're not talking about Inspector Jack Gadgets, the cartoon, but if you know who's Gadgets, the guy that we're talking about, DM us. First one to send the DM gets a Prago swag delivered to your door. If you're an old school reefer, you should know. This thing's ugly. This thing's got to go, guys. So you got, you got demoted. You want it for your tank, Frank? No bad. No bad. Oh, he's not here. Just throw it in there. <laughs> right. Put it in the ghost Yeah, but that's not cool to just throw a coral on somebody's tank. Really? Is it? Brenda, Brenda wants it. Brenda, you want a Oh, oh, Jimmy said he wants him in his. Hold on, hold on. Uh, Jimmy, you want it? You want it, Jimmy? Take it, Jimmy. Jimmy, you want it? Yeah, he, he wants it. He's, he's shaking his head, yes. Oh, cut the peg off. So you put on the floor. All right, we'll make some cutters. Let's go. Back go. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna have to get another Nero 5 pump, especially now that I put Acropoeus on top. Um, other than that, no, I haven't really played with the flow. It's been nothing like, guys, it's been seven months since we set up this tank, and like I said earlier, first six months it was a big struggle. I just couldn't get the tank to get life in it. It was just stripped down to nothing. There was just no life in it. And now that things are doing better, we're concentrating into the dose and the cogwash, are changing the lights, changing the flow, gluing the coils, feeding the fish more, 
now it's game time. Now it's like first six months out of the way, the honeymoon is over. Time to do some work, guys. We can't keep on slacking here. And loose tank over there is looking too good, so I gotta step up my game, man. He's got the little fish over there. He he lost earlier. He was freaking out. You guys seen him freaking out or no? What's his name? Happy? Happy. <laughs> I don't name him because they've been dying. <laughs> I don't want to have to go to the, to the cemetery all the time. No proud of it, guys, seriously. So since you guys say that, you guys can see down here. We just put um, aqua, aqua UV sterilizer. It's working great. I think it's like a little, I don't even know how big it is. To tell you the truth, I just asked the guys to just give me one. We went ahead and installed it a few weeks ago. It's doing great. Here's my little Cogwasser madness. Uh-oh, what's this? So the guys at Aqua Tailors in Japan made this, which is insane. Big fans, big fans. They made a sticker of Tommy and Pokemon and his camera while he was visiting Japan, all about the carbs. What's with the police car? They were pulling you well, over? That's Initial D, that's a Hachiroku from Initial D. It's a Drift, Drift uh, 86 Corolla. What? Yeah. For those of you into drifting formula, Tommy's raw, Tommy's all about that. Right, Tommy? Tofu, it's a tofu delivery car. All right, so. Maybe this is the first one that is going in. Let's see. Thank you, Aqua Tailors. Bling, bling. First one, guys. All right, so we officially have more room. I got this entire canvas, this one inside, so start sending some more stickers. Don't come back and say, oh my gosh, I sent the stickers, then we're out of room. So if you want them to be here, send them now. Screw up the little corners. They're hard to reach. Especially in a little tank like this, guys, you'll be amazed how much harder it is to clean because the tank is so much smaller. From Quality Marine, great food, it's called Nutramar. Marine Complete. Thank you, Chris. You send it for me to try it. I'm not kidding, this is what I'm feeding all the time. You guys see it right here. Fish like it. It's great for the coals, you can smoosh it with, you can smoosh it with your fingers and it comes out powdery, as you can see. Or you can throw a hole as full pallets. I love it. It's really good food. guys we just finished cleaning the pico we just finished cleaning the 80 gallon glue and a bunch of corals talking a bunch of shenanigans i'm tired it's a lot of work maintaining this tank it sounds fun every time you do it then you're in the middle of it and you're like why did i do this but you know what it's so rewarding when you're done it's like you want to sit in front of the tank when it's crystal clear you get to observe all of your corals watch them grow uh, i'm excited to show you guys more uh, it's going to be a little while give me a couple more months i'll show you guys the next update Hopefully I'll see you guys all at Reef Palooza in about a month or so. On the meantime, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give us a like, leave any comments. We'll be glad to answer some comments you guys post below. We'll see you guys soon.